So here we're at the upper edge uh, with the sort of salt marsh transition. So we have some arthrocnemum. We have some, we have some of these uh, um, plants here. You can see this, this uh, mudflat salt panty area. Um, is uh, the, the ground looks a little bit, a little kind of tufty, a li little soft, a little dusty. Um, and that's because we have some subsurface action, some, some invertebrates down there uh, doing their do. Um, and as you look up this way, you can see that we, we really transitioned quite rapidly from salt marsh plain, mud flat, this sort of edge salt marsh vegetation, and then on into more of the terrestrial plain. Before we get really high up, we have this sort of intermediary invasive grass dominated area. So this is not ideal. We'd like to not have, not have all this stuff. But um, regardless, it's, uh, it's still relatively well functioning um, for this area. And a lot of this looks like we have a lot of um, uh, Desticulus spicata, salt, salt grass. Um, and so uh, this is cool. This is, this is a great restoration for um, uh, 20 years on. It, 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 there's still more to do. We can always improve stuff, but it looks like it's, it, it's worked well, at least what we've done so far.